Use the zip wall heavy duty zipper when you have a barrier that's going to be up for a while. If there will be a lot of traffic in and out, or if the work site will get cold, this zipper stays on in temperatures below freezing. To install this zipper, unroll it and determine its placement. Be sure the pull is at the floor. You want to make sure that the end of the zipper is below where the plastic bends at the floor. Then, starting at the top, peel the backing off one side of the zipper, removing the paper, pressing the zipper onto the sheeting as you go. When the zipper is in place, open the zipper to the top, and then cut the opening with the Zip Wall Zipper Knife Sheeting Cutter. This special knife has two blades about three quarters of an inch apart. Simply poke them through the plastic sheeting until the blades begin to cut. Then, bring the knife down, cutting a three-quarter inch swath. This cuts a channel to keep the plastic from jamming the zipper teeth. This knife comes with each box of heavy-duty zippers. This zipper is great for use in temporary interior barriers where the temperature doesn't go below 55 degrees Fahrenheit. It comes with two zippers and two ties per box. The zipper knife that comes with the heavy-duty zipper does not work with the standard zipper. To install this zipper, unroll it and determine its placement. Be sure the pull is at the floor and that the end of the zipper is below where the plastic bends. Then, starting at the top, peel the backing off the zipper and press it firmly onto the sheeting as you go. When the zipper is in place, carefully open it, making sure to keep the adhesive in contact with the plastic. With a razor knife, cut the opening using the teeth as a guide. Now with the zipper open, use your thumb and forefinger to press the plastic and the zipper together for a solid bond. 